this is the third uh, assignment sorry the third problems called assignment problems uh, uh, from the perspective of brute force particularly from the exhaustive search uh, this problem can be solved by exhaustive search um, before we discuss further so we need to understand what is the assignment problem so in general basically consider uh, n people this is n let's say we have only four to make it simple and also the end job here we have a job zero until job three also for job uh, we need to assign it to execute uh, to assign one person per job so one person restrict to one job that is each person is assigned to exactly one job and each job is uh, assigned to exactly one person uh, this is the problem so in general, basically, you can see here, this also under permutation problem, under combinatorial problem, permutation, where we have 4 for this year, 4, and maybe we can uh, use the same uh, permutation uh, uh, formula just now, where we have the n factorial, n minus r factorial. So, this n equal to 4, pack 4 factorial, uh, uh, 0 factorial, which is 1, 24. Uh, permutation or combination for this so uh, from the concept of uh, brute force or exercises in particular so we have to list out all 24 possible solution for this but the aim now is to find which one actually the uh, minimum cost for this let's say for the cost here this is the cost here 9 to we need in total what is the minimum cost so we have to list out all possible or possible solution and next step is to find which one actually the minimum cost taking the same example just now where we have four persons and four job so we need to assign for each person and each job exactly once so these are columns a row is actually the person sorry a row of the person a jobs column here so for this uh, from the perspective of exotic search we have to list all the possible or feasible solution uh, this is a possible solution then we take one two three four this is a column one two three four basically uh, for the person one we take this job person two we take this job person three we take this job person four we take this job so actually one uh, person only one job for each because one for job but person one take only job zero not the rest person two take only job two not the others person three here take job three not the others person four take job four not the others job and you can see here actually only one person one job and there's no overlapping in terms of person and in terms of job here and after that, we, we calculate the total of this, uh, what we call the total cost. Let's say 9 plus 4 plus 1, 18 here. Okay. And the second one, person 1, take job 1. Person 2, take job 2. Person 3, here. Person 3, take job 4, here. Okay. Uh, person 3 take job for sorry here and uh, person uh, 4 take job uh, 3 here so in total 9 plus 4 plus 8 plus 9 30 and so on so forth this is actually the process of uh, to list all the possible solution uh, from the perspective of uh, exoticists to solve the assignment problem and when we have uh, done uh, as we calculated just now it uh, end up with 24 possible solution from there you have to choose you have to decide which one actually the minimum total cost here that will be actually the uh, solution for this job assignment